hi hello everyone welcome back to my youtube channel today i come back to you with another haul this time it's not a charity haul this time i bring you an online shopping that i did i just needed a few things um so i went online and bought some items on the online shop very i needed just a few things but especially i needed a tracksuit bottom and a sports bra but with it i bought a, a few more things um that i thought i thought okay let's see if i can find items for 10 pounds and under so yeah i managed to buy items that were 10 pounds and under except for one item only so i was able to stick to my goal and i think i did very well so i'll share with you the things that i bought here i bought this is the sports bra that i bought i really needed one so i bought this one this one is a shock absorber and it is a size 38c i bought this one for 29 pounds yeah it was 29 pounds this is the, the the most expensive item that i bought on this haul um your auntie loves a bargain you know she's cheap so i always go for cheaper items but i couldn't find anything that i really liked that was um cheap so i had to settle for this one and i also bought myself a tracksuit bottom so how about this one this is a adidas size medium i bought this one for 25 pounds it was on clearance unfortunately it's no longer there on the website but it was on clearance so i bought it for 25 pounds so these were the two items sports items that i bought and i also bought these i'm wearing them anyway i bought these dino boots they were on clearance they were now five pounds so i bought these ones as well for five pounds and here's another one so i bought this mascara don't know if you can see it nyx wet the hype it's waterproof mascara i i needed mascara so i bought this one and i also bought these this these are the sunglasses they are by very they are I will list everything down below but let me see if I can find the receipt here yeah they are called cat eye sunglasses with bro by very I bought this for 12 pounds so this is the only item that was above 10 pounds that I bought um, on my target so these are the sunglasses they are pretty good cheap but i like them they are pretty good so yeah these are the sunglasses i think if you go on the website you you'll find them they might be still there i didn't check for them when i was checking and i also bought this ball this one was um retailing for 15 pounds and it was now on clearance for 12 what am i saying it was retailing for 15 pounds and i bought it on clearance for six pounds yes it was it was six pounds on clearance i still have the receipt here yes this one here That's... so yeah i will try it let's try it we go 
Did you like his visit? Yeah, it's good. It's very nice. We'll leave it there. And I also bought, I didn't know that Topshop does uh, makeup items. I didn't know that, to tell the truth. I, I just found out when I went on Ferris website and I bought this brush. It's a um, Topshop one. It's a sculpting brush. I bought this one for Topshop. I bought this one for five pounds. It's very soft and it, it is quite dense. It's it's quite a good quality brush actually. I think I'll go on the website and buy more brushes from um, on the very website or Topshop web website and see if I can find some more because I really like this one. It's really nice. It, it is good quality and I like the denseness of it. So yeah, that's the brush. So these are the only small bits and bobs that I bought. And I also bought this dress. Um, it was on clearance. I bought it for £10. Unfortunately, I went back on the website to try and see if they still have it. It's, it's not there. I don't know if they put it back up, but it wasn't there when I checked. I bought it for £10. It's uh, called a turtleneck dress. Is it? Oh no, let me check. I'll check. Don't worry, I don't have my glasses. So your aunt has to... It's an age thing, don't worry. Uh... Oh, this one is called Satin Sequin Embleshed. What? Hi. And it's, um, okay, this one is orange. This one was on clearance. But when I went back on the website, they still have the sequins, uh, the Satin Sequin one, different colors, uh, but they are retailing for £15. So, yeah, this one, you can still find it on the on the website. It, it is still there so yeah 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 this one is a long sleeve this one it's called long sleeve turtleneck swing dress so yeah this one was 10 pounds like as i said that i went back on the website i couldn't find it but there are similar dresses there that are retailing for like seven pounds fifty. So, and uh, when I bought this one, when it came, when I looked at it, this is a size sixteen, and when I looked at it, I thought it 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 was going to be um too big for me, but uh, it is okay because it it's quite loose, but I think that's how that's the style that's how it's supposed to look because even on the model. On the website it looked loose on here and um, these it's long sleeves and the sleeves they um, they fit me quite perfectly because I've got quite big upper arms they are chunky so if I bought a size 14 it wouldn't fit it would be it wouldn't go in on my sleeves unless it will be sleeveless so yeah it is it is quite loose and nice and it's the material is quite thick it is quite thick of which i don't think it will be um i don't know i'll try it um during summer but i think it's quite warm so it it would it would be suitable for winter so that's the dress the turtleneck dress and we are also bought another dress. I bought this jersey one. This is jersey material dress. Um, okay, sorry, this this is by Very. And this one, it's Very too. This is by Very as well. 
this one is a size 14 it's a bit flared at the bottom long sleeves too i don't know what's with me and long sleeves but those were the cheap dresses that i could buy that i liked that were on the website i bought this dress for five pounds it was on clearance as well i think it was um, retailing for 18 pounds and then it got re reduced up to five pounds i checked on the website i couldn't find it i don't know if they put it back up but i, I couldn't find it when i checked again so yeah i bought this one for five pounds so that was really really nice and um i think i i did well i managed to stick to my challenge that i gave to myself so a big pet on the back for me i um i like to find bargains just like everyone else i also love quality nice things you know there are some high street brands that i cannot afford i cannot walk in and just you know buy them because they're expensive for me but i can buy them when they are reduced i can afford to so i i do frequent sales you know and discounted items and i tend to find things that i like there that i discounted and i also am a huge huge charity shopper i buy a lot of my items in charity shops I know charity shops are not for everyone. I know second-hand items are not for everyone. But you don't only find second-hand items in charity shops. You can also find new things. Someone can buy something that is too big or they just don't like it and then they donate it. And if you go in there, you will be able to score that item. You remember, If you remember, this was on my last, on my first haul, my very first YouTube haul. <laughs> video that i did you know this one is my second one anyway so i bought this i think this was six or four pounds in debra in the charity shop it is a phase eight top i cannot walk into phase eight and just buy you know their stuff for me it is expensive but this was second hand but it still has a lot of life in it so you know you can buy new things you can buy second-hand things even furniture frequent sunday markets facebook market is another place that i buy a lot of my furniture from you know small furniture items if you love things like diy you can buy something and you know make it into something that you want you can just paint it diy it into something that you really like on facebook market and spoke is another one i like car book, book sales sunday markets charity shops facebook market clearances in in the high street online sales all those places you know you can find good quality items so yeah i'm someone who loves to get a bargain i do i challenge myself every time um, and I, it's amazing what you can find, you know, if you really look out there. So, yeah, it's not like that. I don't buy new things. I do buy. I can walk into it if I need something. If I really need something, I can walk into a shop and buy, and buy it as well. But my go-to places are charity shops as well. I love I do love charity shopping. You know, you don't have to spend a lot of money to look good. You know, you can find nice things and look nice in them. So, yeah, let me stop preaching, guys. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. Please come back again. I will list everything down below. Come back again. I'll bring up another video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. Bye.